New study, though, shedding some light on the coronavirus when it actually came to. We've been going back talking about if it came from a lab, where did it come from in nature, but also when it actually got to the U.S. Right, and this new study published in the Journal of Clinical Infectious Diseases is important as we look back to try to piece this kind of detective work together. Um, this study was based on blood samples taken from over 24,000 people early on in 2020, between January 2nd and March 18. They analyzed those samples looking for COVID-19, SARS-CoV-2 antibodies. And based on this, this study suggests that yes, this virus was here in the U.S. as early as December 2019. It's important to remember the first travel-related documented case in the United States wasn't until January 15th, 2020. Now, this study does have limitations. There can be false positives. But again, it is important that we try to figure out the past as we look forward into the future and how we can learn to live with this virus. But to see this milestone, and especially for you too. Yeah. I mean, I don't even know if they were officially keeping count of COVID deaths when you all started this show a year we ago, were, right? Like, really, and remember yeah. that that number is likely grossly right. underestimated. Yeah. These are only confirmed COVID-19 deaths, so they're likely much more. Mm -hmm. Dr. Jen, thank you. As yeah. always, we appreciate it. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.